There have been many fashion successes in the 90 Day Fiancé franchise, but in 2022 there were just as many epic fashion fails. Whether it's on Instagram, the tell-alls, or even on the show itself, cast members often love showing off what they think are their best outfits. Though sometimes they wow viewers with their style prowess, other times fans get a good laugh out of their fashion faux pas. 90 Day Fiancé is not a fashion show. There is no requirement to dress for success. However, some fashion fails are just too mind-blowing to ignore. 2022 had more than its fair share of fashion mishaps throughout the 90 Day Fiancé franchise, including several of the spin-off shows. Several cast members have become the targets of would-be fashion expert fans who can't wait to share their hot takes on social media. 90 Day Fiancé fans roasted Ben Rathbun's Peruvian garb One of the most talked about style blunders in 2022 occurred during 90 Day Fiancé, before the 90 Days Season 5, when Ben Rathburn was trying to patch things up with Mahogany Roca and her parents in Peru, after he stood them up for breakfast. 90 Day Fiancé star Ben showed up in what was supposed to be a traditional Peruvian outfit, complete with a chin-strapped cowboy hat, sweater poncho, and vest. In a Reddit thread started by you, and Bite Psychological 8, one fan said, I literally was waiting for him to pull out two chrome cap guns and start firing them off in the air like some spoiled kid playing cowboy. A three-way mirror could have prevented Wive Arellano's fashion disaster Another fashion fail that had viewers talking in 2022 was Yvette Wive Arellano's see-through dress on 90 Day Fiancé Season 9. Fans were used to Eve's fiancé, Mohamed Abdelhamed, criticizing her for wearing clothes that he considered to be too revealing. Most of the time, he was just being controlling. But during the translucent dress disaster, Muhammad was actually spot on. Reddit user U Pomegranate Pants 99 posted, Eve's outfit was bad and it has nothing to do with Muhammad being a Muslim. Her dress is paper thin. It's not classy. Considering that viewers could see Eve black thong through the dress, it is not surprising that most Reddit users agreed. Sometimes 90 Day Fiancé fans have to agree to disagree while 90 Day Fiancé fans often have a collective opinion on cast members' fashion fails, Tim Malcolm is one person that tends to divide viewers. On the 90 Day, the single life season 3 tell-all, Tim wore pink ripped-up pants, which naturally got people talking. Many fans made fun of the pants, while others were adamant about defending the 42-year-old and his right to make his own style choices. There's no debate about Jibra Bell's fashion fails there has been, however, very little dispute when it comes to Jibra Bell's fashion fails. Jibra, who was engaged to and married Miona Bell on 90 Day Fiancé Season 9, was often called out on his daring outfits, which he usually made sure matched with Miona's. But it was the suit he wore on the tell all that really put him over the top with fans. Fellow castmate, Patrick Mendez's brother John kept calling him S.P. Achilles, because his suit was covered in multicolored sequins from top to bottom. If, at the tell-all, Jibra had not been so rude and confrontational, Patrick, and viewers, might have found the outfit amusing. Yet his negative attitude caused fans to post comments like this on a Reddit thread started by you, PM underscore me underscore underscore your underscore drama, Spackle's outfit is giving off a heavy Party City 70s man, bagged costume vibes.
everyone has different taste. One person's wow, may be another person's EU. Yet when just about everyone on the planet is calling a 90-day fiancé cast member out on their style choice, it can firmly be classified as a true fashion fail. 2022 had a whole lot of them, and 2023 will probably have even more. Source, U, Invite Psychological 8, Reddit, U, Pomegranate Pants 99, Reddit, U, PM underscore me underscore underscore your underscore drama, Reddit. Man